everybody um it's been a while since i've posted a video on here i was trying something new and it just didn't work out so but anyway um let's talk about i've been feeling kind of regretful about going to the neurologist that my primary care begged me to go see because he was worried about my MS, which I don't call it my MS because I didn't ask for it. It's not mine. It's the MS, MS, whatever. And um, when I had my brain scan, the neurologist was like, oh, the MS is sleeping. That's good. Well, let's put you on something. Because I wasn't taking anything. I was doing a vitamin regimen. I was taking a weekly uh, vitamin D. I was taking my B vitamins. I was taking turmeric. I was taking all kinds of um, medications. What I really just needed was I needed something for symptoms of, you know, spasticity. And I needed just some baclofen. I, it's really all I needed. And instead, you know. He put me on the Abagio, which I don't know. I, I didn't mind it because it was a pill, but the problem was, was that it made me really tired and I kind of like lost interest in wanting to take my vitamins, to take care of myself, to exercise, to do things. And, um, Why couldn't you just leave me alone? <laughs> I don't understand. Um, and they do leave me alone. They don't even want to bother doing an MRI because I am still up walking and talking and I don't poop and pee myself and uh, all that. So why put me on medicine? But I did have a talk with my doctor before he left the practice. He said, okay, so you just want to do more holistically and I'm like yeah you know leave me be I so I'm slowly coming back to trying to exercise uh, I am back taking amantadine which he prescribed for me while I was on the Abagio and it didn't work well now for some reason now that I've kind of flushed it all out out the medicine um diamantadine it works i it's not like provigil or i can't be on those medications because they they make me crazy <laughs> so i uh try on the amantadine and it, it works it actually gives me a little spark and i can get things done and so hopefully I hope you're not hearing lawnmower noises. My my oldest son is mowing the backyard. <laughs> well, anyway. But, uh, yeah, that's an update. Uh, I know some people, you know, you do what you want to do. And, you know, and I'm not going to fault you if that's what you want to do. I've been living with this now for... twenty. 22 years, 23 years, 25 years, I don't know. It's been a long time. And, you know, it doesn't, the Yankee adage is, you know, if it's not broke, don't fix it. Anyway, have a great day, and uh, I hope I will be talking to you guys soon. Alright, bye.